Step four in the span entry protocol uh, procedure is to find the designated port for each segment. Notice I didn't say each switch, but each segment. So let's go down here to that step and take a look at the rules. First of all, every port on the root bridge is active or designated port. The port opposite every root port is a designated port. So as I look around here, I've got a root port here on switch 4. Well, yes, the opposite is already designated. On switch 0, I have a root port here, and the opposite is designated. Uh, down here on switch 2, I've got a root port on this right-hand uh, link that goes up to switch 4. I've got a root port already set up there, so the opposite becomes a designated port. So that leaves three uh, lines here, three segments. The one going kitty corner here between the these two switches. Then the left hand switch uh, link of this, or left hand segment of this double link here, and then the bottom one. So let's take a look at switch zero. Let's take a look at this bottom one. How can I decide which side here is the designated port? Well, the designated port will be on the switch with the lowest cost to the root bridge. Well, switch zero here has a four cost to the root bridge, whereas switch two has an eight cost to the root bridge. Therefore, I know that this side, the switch zero side, is the designated port. Let's take a look at switch four to switch zero, the one kitty corner here. Well, switch four has a cost of four to get to the root bridge. And switch zero has four to get to the root bridge. So, oh dear, uh, they both have four. They have the same cost. So I'm going to have to go on to the tiebreaker, which is the switch which, uh, with the lowest bridge ID. And the one up here at the top, switch four, has an ID of AAAAAA. And the one down here in the bottom left has DDDDD. So the one here at the top wins. It gets the designated port. Same thing is true here of the uh, left-hand double line, double connection we have here. Uh, the switch 4 has AAAA, switch 2 has CCCC, so we're going to put that designated port on switch 4.